Back in the day, we made our living from fishing and farming. Today, our largest industry is tourism. I was born and raised in Reykjavik. It is my hometown. Besides having fun at work, I do have hobbies like fishing, cycling and music. My name is Harido Inge H. Gurmansson, and I work as a system administrator at the city of Reykjavik. I'm very interested in improving processes, and I'd like to tell you about Parallels Mac Management. To tell you why Parallels Mac Management suited our workflow so well, I have to go back a little in time, specifically before the year 2015. In 2007, we started using Microsoft SCCM, the System Center Configuration Manager. With this system, you could immediately manage all PCs, distribute software, manage software licenses, remotely control computers, and manage computers at a single location. It was an important breakthrough in our environment. By 2015, we had about 200 Macs, which was like a closed book for us. SCCM just could not manage them because it required additional time and resources from IT, as well as increasing security risk. And also, it required a different workflow for managing Macs compared to the Windows PC management. In the summer of 2015, a good friend introduced me to a solution called Parallels Mac Management. With this solution, you can manage Macs with SCCM. Parallels Mac Management can automatically enroll Macs into SCCM, and then from SCCM console, we could easily distribute software to them. We could install the opening system and applications to remote locations. And it will support Apple Device Enrollment Program, or DEP, once it's available in Iceland. Life is wholly different now. You can't imagine how long it took to install an update or software on the remote Mac. Through reports to the SCCM console, we obtain all the same information about Windows and Macs. Also, Parallels Mac Management supports configuration profiles for Mac OS, which allows enforced settings and compliance on Macs in one place. To cut a long story short, it has been essential for us to manage Macs in the same way as Windows PCs. This has been difficult. Until today.